So guys, for the first step, you want to get into this screen. Now to get into this screen, you want to turn off your computer from the power button and then turn it back on again from the power button. Now as your computer is turning on, you're going to be seeing the Windows loading screen. Now once you see the Windows loading screen, you want to turn off your computer from the power button again and then turn it on again. You want to repeat this three times and then it's going to take you into here, where it's going to say automatic repair. You want to click on advanced options and then it's going to take you to here. And now once you're on this, you want to click on troubleshoot and then click on advanced options. Now we're going to be trying out a few things. So first we're going to be trying out system restore. So you're going to click on system restore. And now once this loads up, you want to click on your username. And now once this comes up, if you have a restore point, then you can go back to it. So click on next and then follow the steps and then you can go back to your restore point and then hopefully this will fix your problem. If you do not have a restore point like me, that's fine. We're going to click on cancel. And now for the second method, you want to click on troubleshoot and then click on advanced options and then click on start of repair. And now you want to diagnose your PC and wait for this to load. Hopefully this will fix your problem, but if not, then you want to click on advanced options and then click on troubleshoot, advanced options again, and then click on command prompt. And now once you run this, you want to type in C colon, click on enter. Then you want to type in CD space backslash windows backslash system32 backslash config, click on enter. And now you want to type in MD space backup, click on enter. And now you want to type in copy space star dot star space backup, click on enter. And now you want to type in CD space regback, click on enter. And now you want to type in copy space star dot star space dot dot, click on enter. And now you want to type in A and click on enter. And now you want to type in exit and click on enter. And now once you're back on this, you want to continue on to Windows 10 and then the problem should be fixed.